Okay, hello everyone. Um, my topic is uh, about Open Source Asia Summit 2012, and thank you you all coming to listening. And that is what I want to discuss about. Uh, that is agenda. Okay, first introduce myself. I'm L, and I come from Taiwan, Taipei. Then I am also uh, some community uh, member. Then I also are uh, the chief in the organizer and the sorry and the coordinator of Open Asia Summit 2012. Then I'm also from uh, Asia Labs Taipei. Okay, let me uh, talk about. Oh, hmm? Okay, uh, let me talk about Open Source Asia Summit. Uh, first, I must uh, great for SUSE and Open Source all sponsor to support our event, and that is very good for us. And thank you very much. And about Open Source Asia Summit, that is from 2014. And uh, that time, they really did a very good uh, event for Asia uh, Open Source community. And that time, uh, they made uh, awesome things. So very lucky for us, we have the second time to uh, have Open Source Asia Summit in Taipei. And that is where we are, and we are very, very got a lot of fun there, and a lot of people have a lot of fun there. And uh, that is a two days event and a one day workshop for the whole event. That is uh, what our schedule, and. Uh, I also do some uh, analyze, and you can so that we got a very good balance between uh, any different topic. And totally, we got uh, 64 or uh, 46 uh, submission of topic, and uh, uh, there is uh, except two. Uh, 26, then, uh, yeah, nothing special. And I want to uh, talk about some uh, point about this Asia Summit. The first one is speakers, and uh, we, we have totally, I guess it's, 23 speakers and from different place. And the uh, Asia people is, uh, yeah, almost 18% and 20% uh, uh, from uh, Europe. And thank you very much for those speakers uh, give us very good uh, talk. And uh, uh, we have different uh, event types, and uh, uh, most is short talks, but their difficulty level is not quite high. So I think uh, most community friends in Taiwan or other country they can easier to join us and find some fun. And the second point is we uh, have local community co-hosts and that is gave us very good uh, support because uh, the, the uh, co-work friend, co-work co community, uh, they are, have very good uh, talk about a uh, lot of things uh, like uh, any IT things. So and I also want thanks, and if you have chance to Taiwan, maybe you can keep in touch with them. 
that is a uh, hard layer. And the point three is uh, we uh, have a lot of community in Taiwan give us help, and uh, you can saw that uh, our open source community there is uh, from China, from Japan, and the Taiwan, Indonesia layer is very good support for us. And uh, in fact, uh, I must think uh, I must introduce Sakana, but I think a lot of people know him already. But that time he is not in Taiwan, so. But he still gave us a lot of support, so we really did a very good job, but he did a very good support to us, so thanks, Sakana. And uh, uh, about other uh, community, some is about uh, they provide a very good uh, networking environment in our meal and uh, uh, some uh, open, the OCF TWs means uh, Open Culture Commun uh, Foundation. They do a lot of uh, open source promotion or uh, open source event in Taiwan and they also give us a lot of help. So we cannot have that uh, Good, very good conference with all them. Okay, and uh, yep, that uh, our community is also. Uh, oh wait. Oh, that uh, I want to show you is uh, our community uh, speaker and. Uh, our co-work speaker, uh, they all attended the whole event all day, but uh, in that day, uh, because we, we don't have very good weather like those days, so uh, people who uh, attend Asia Summit 2012 is not uh, so many like uh, like what do we have? So that is still bad to us. Okay, and uh, yeah, that is point. We got a uh, lot of uh, very strong sponsors, so thank you them very much. And okay, let me talk about something. What is special for us? Uh, the first thing is we consider about uh, uh, local people in Taiwan is most likely uh, attending workshop because they want to learn something and uh, just not just learn and her they want also to learn by themselves. So we uh, do this. Make a decide to have one day workshop. They invite people to join us and learn and do themselves. Yeah. Then uh, another special thing is uh, we have a very uh, senior contributor in Taiwan. Then uh, we invite him to uh, to give him a, a special gift because he's still uh, doing very good things with Open Source Taiwan. Okay, and uh, also we because we have one uh, co-host study area and uh, the member of them is a very famous Linux education blog. Uh, we call him Weber. And uh, most uh, people who learn or who use Mandarin uh, will know him. So that is what our point. And OK. 
What more we have? Uh, we have uh, very lucky. We have a very good designer volunteer to make a lot of uh, virtual things to us. Uh, the all of those is uh, from one volunteer. So that is why we got the chance to make this. And the another one is we try to co-host release party with another digital Ubuntu Taiwan community. And uh, we do uh, some uh, very funny things, like uh, we have a lighting talk with from dif different sites have different uh, issue and some sometimes they will discuss discuss about all different. So it's very very funny, and uh, that is also good help us to uh, promoting our open association summit. That is before the last last night before open association summit. Okay, and I want to say some. Uh, what difficult to us is uh, the first one is uh, how to invite local people attend our event because uh, in Taiwan we have uh, more than 100 event one year. It's been uh, 2012. There's more than 120, I guess, uh, in Taiwan and. Uh, Every month we have big, one big is more than, it's almost uh, more than thousand people for so, uh, software, technical, or open source every month. So that is quite hard for us to uh, invite people to attending our event. And uh, in the same day, we also know there is another two uh, conference in Taipei, and uh, all them more than two, no, five hundred people there. So it's quite hard to uh, to think about how to invite people to come. Yeah, and uh, what we learned this time and. How we do next for uh, Taiwan open source community? The first is uh, I think a lot of co local community who be a volunteer to help uh, 2012 Asia Summit. Oh, sorry, 2015. Uh, then I guess they all do very well, and they all learn some skill to host the com conference and the co-work because we have a co-host. So the co-work with another community is also important. And that is, uh, they did a very good job the time. And uh, the next is what's next for our open source Taiwan community. And uh, now uh, we are uh, some, we meet a lot of friends there on uh, Asia Summit and uh, we try to make a plan for our yearly plans is with SIP uh, or OpenStack or in the, our co host uh, study area. Then maybe after one year, we can have a mini conference, mini summit uh, for Open Society in Open Society Taiwan. And yep, that we yeah okay. And okay, let me uh, introduce next journey to Asia. Now, uh, already you 
maybe already know uh, this time, Open Source Asia Summit is in Indonesia. And uh, uh, Indonesia team, they did very good job and they, they, st they start very hard work for that. And you also can find uh, our OSEM page. There's already have Open Source Asia Summit 2016. And uh, now they are couple papers. And because I guess that's, uh, they will have an announcement in our news talk, uh, Open Source talk, but uh, maybe later, so uh, anyway, just and please submit your papers to Open Source Asia Summit. Only six, uh, 39 days left. And uh, we are also once we have next uh, Open Source Asia Summit. Okay. Any question? What uh, what plans does the Taiwan team have when it comes to uh, things like Cost Cup? Um, will there be a large presence at Cost Cup, and what assistance do you need from the project for Cost Cup or the board to help you do that? I'm sorry, uh, so you mean assistance? Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah, I mean, do you need help with Cost Cup? What help is it that you would need from the Open Source Board or the project or the community uh, to make sure that Open Source uh, delivers at Cost Cup? Yeah, for sure. We always need help. <laughs> yeah, because we, that is why we have yearly plan. We want more people uh, join uh, our community in Taiwan. So, yep. Any other questions? Okay, thank you very much.